My name is Jeff Chang. My current artist practice is in the medium of photography. I mostly use photography to express um, issues of um, diversity and identity. In every social political movement, artists have been very much at the forefront of creating visible bodies of work to in, 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 encourage change. My previous project called Fearless is on openly gay, lesbian, bisexual, transgender athletes on high school and college sports teams. And that project led into um, my current one on Don't Ask, Don't Tell, photographing gays and lesbians in the military. If they were to be discovered, that would be grounds for dismissal. In that way, I think it's a really bold way of activism um, from these service members to, to sort of step up and do their little part um, to try to make a difference in their current situation. I think that photography allows uh, for you to say a lot in just a single frame, um, in a still image. Um, the photographs of the closet service members were published in the New York Times. Um, those images wound up um, being widely seen in the military. I remember hearing back from one of my um, previous photo subjects who worked in the Pentagon, how his boss had the article on his desk and didn't even realize that somebody who had been in the photo project was in the same room. That's all stuff that other art mediums such as maybe video and film have a harder time of reaching um, that kind of immediate uh, response. On this wall right here is pretty much uh, where I lay out a lot of my books and publications. The larger photographs here are part of a limited edition number of prints um, that we've put together as a collectible series of the body of work. So they range from 2003 to 2009. Shot. This is all of the openly gay and lesbian athletes on high school college sports teams project. I do a lot of my Photoshop work back over here. Okay, so this is um, this is all work from the first set of photographs from Don't Ask, Don't Tell. Uh, when when we do Photoshop, I don't really t do anything to the photographs. I just uh, color correct a little bit, brightness, light, and then I export them here in my studio to print. I think being an artist is incredibly hard. Um, you you really you've got to do it because you love it. You've got to do it because you believe so much in your own work and what you're trying to say and that you actually have something unique to say to the world. I think that um, a lot of artists um, forget that, that that's the power of, of making art, is you're trying to bring to light a voice that nobody else has ever heard before. It's very difficult because you balance out your work's integrity with the demands of the art world. One of the things I've realized is the art world doesn't reward artists who engage in social documentary a lot. Um, you know, artists that get rewarded probably work very much in your world and conceptual work. So these are all things to really take into account. And you're not gonna find success or the art world success in everything that you do that has social merit. Artists need to really believe in their work and they need to uh, realize that, that the pressures of the art world should consume them. The pressures to sell work, the pressures to show work, they need to be above that um, and, and the rest will 